Hello, new friend. My name is Fred. The words you hear are in my head. I say I said my name is Fred. And I've been... very naughty. The story I'm about to tell, I tell you I will tell it well, is of my dear Aunt Muriel, and just how I've been... naughty. Viola the farm, my aunt lives here, with precious pup and husband dear. My heart beats fast as I drew near. I feel so nice and naughty. I thought just how excited they must be that I would come today. They'd shout, come Fred, huzzah, hooray. Dear boy, you look so naughty. That's when my tired eyes beheld a doggy dog like doggy smelled. D-O-G is what he spelled. And that's how I spell naughty. Alone was I with tender courage, and all his fur, his furry furage, which, I say, did encourage me to be quite naughty. Courage, your hair, it reminds me of the first time I knew just how I felt about hair. It was a day I'd not forget. The day that I first met my pet. Oh, what a lovely gift to get. I'd never felt so... naughty. My fuzzy friend is what he was. This darling little ball of fuzz. And oh, such fuzz, such fuzz it does. Demand that I be... naughty. He looked at me, his fetching eyes, and fetching fur did hypnotize, and fill with joy and fill with sighs, and that's when I got naughty. Now, now, you shouldn't play in the toilet. This dripping hair, this droopy curl. Unfold sweet memories of a girl Whose tresses, oh, they twist and twirl And tempt me to be naughty Barbara, my love, was named And her fair hair a mane untamed Until one evening, I'm ashamed I got a little Naughty. The look upon my young love's face was sweet as lace. But in this case, I realized she needed space. Never more was I naughty. Well, maybe not never. Dear cur, your fur and fleece remind of nothing found in humankind, but for one fellow who did find me to be in a certain mood. Into my shop he walked one day, with bush above and beard bouquet. That's no toupee, I pray, no way. I could help be, you know. I'd never seen such hair before, his bangs they sang, his neck they beckoned, eyebrows, armpits, all were reckoned. Soon I figured, what the heck, and guess how I was? Naughty. Sweet pooch, afraid I'll shave your tail? Why now, that would be weird. So ends our little story. But then my landlords did resume to free me from that porcelain tomb and ferry to a private room 
your hero, Ever Doughty. Goodbye, dear aunt. I'll miss your farm and Eustace's jubilant charm. And farewell courage. What's the harm? If I was slightly naughty. With love, Fred. <laughs>